Hey, it's Katrina Sawa here uh, with jumpstartyourmarketing.com with an information about a live webinar that I'm doing. It's free and it's for those of you who know you need to learn more about Zoom as well as running events on virtual platforms like Zoom, but anything, it could be anything. So we're talking about events here and events to me means anything that you're going to speak on. So if you're gonna run a, run a call with a group of people, and even if it's gonna be a casual call, that's an event. That's a casual call. Maybe even a one-on-one -on -one Facebook Live or something, that's an event. Uh, anywhere from a one-hour webinar that I'm gonna be doing about this, uh, that's an event, right? Maybe it's an in-person, you have a, a speaking gig, or you want to have a meetup, even if it's free, low cost, it doesn't matter, however much it is, that's an event. Whether you want to have a retreat and you want to go away to, uh, I don't know, Hawaii or India to have an retreat, that's an event. Maybe you want to have a three-day business training or some other kind of event to uh, launch a program that you're going to do or launch one of your high-end programs and sell one of your high-end programs, that's an event. So pretty much anything these days we do is an event if you're going to host it yourself. And that's what I'm talking about here because hosting events is means that you're building a community and you're elevating yourself as the influencer in your industry or at least one of them one of the and you need to be an influencer these days in order to really grow a broader reach and have a, a bigger expansion um, of people that are following you or maybe on your email list whether they're following you on social media whether they're following you on YouTube uh, even if you're just local, you got to have that influencer status and you got to build that community. You got to make people want to listen to you, right? So being a leader is important. So being a leader, you're going to run events. <laughs> Very, I don't, I know some people say, I'm not going to run an event. That's not my style, but you're going to do an event online or offline at some point. So why not monetize the heck out of it, right? Without being super salesy. I know I've gone to events and you probably have too where they're just selling me the whole time and I hardly got any really good content out of it. Whether it was a, an hour or a three day conference, I've been there. I get it. We don't want to create that. We don't want to create that experience for anybody. I know. And that's why I'm talking to you is because I've learned how to do this over the last 12 years. I've been doing live events for 12 years and uh, monetizing the heck out of them to high end programs, making easy yes offers. I even have most of my attendees selling stuff within the event. They love my events. Okay. So you don't have to do that. I'm just saying that I know how to really engage an audience, whether it's in person and now online. I'm doing virtual events. I host virtual calls. I have membership programs, masterminds. So I have groups from four people to uh, 70 people on a line where I'm really engaging them and I'm, I'm working the back end, the front end, the uh, all of the above, right? So we have to learn a lot of different skills in order to really master and monetize events in our business. And I I'm doing this webinar it's on July 30th and you can attend. And once it happens live, the recording will be there. So you can always go and get access to this recording if you don't make it live. So if you go to jumpstartyourmarketing.com forward slash, uh, forward slash webinar dash events. So jumpstartyourmarketing.com forward slash webinar dash events. Okay. And that's hyphen events. Uh, so go there. Uh, if you can't find it, you know, send me an email from the website or something and say, I'm looking for your free webinar on events, jumpstarting your events. And the title is jumpstart your events in person or virtual, how to build your community, grow your influence and rock your profits. And this is really how we're going to have to embrace, I think, the future, especially after COVID. There's so many things we can do online, you guys. It's ridiculous. I usually fly around the country attending live events and speaking at live events. And I spend about 30000 a year doing that on my dime, okay, to find clients and build my list and my community and then get people who are interested into my programs, products, and coaching. Uh, I'm telling you, I have made just 
I have made more money doing it virtually than I was before flying around the country. So I'm going to show you both though, because I'm hoping that someday we can do our live events again. I love doing live events. Okay. And attending them. So no matter what kind of events you like, we want to embrace the virtual for sure. So you want to get good at that regardless. Okay. But if you're an, a live event person, you want to really embrace this strategy sooner than later. It can be a business model where you monetize the actual event itself. It can be a marketing strategy to get more people to other programs, products, and services that you offer. It's an amazing thing, you guys. Please sign up for this webinar. I'm going to be doing a program after that. It's a paid program, but it's going to be a short-term training on everything I'm going to teach from the webinar. So just come and check it out, get some nuggets, get some idea on what you can do and why you want to do it. And then we'll have a conversation if you want to do more. Okay. So we'll talk to you on July 30th. If you come live and then you can come and do Q and a it's from four to 5 PM Pacific time, uh, for one hour. So we'll talk really fast and give you a ton of stuff and, and then we'll go from there. All right. Bye guys.